Hey guys, today I'll show you my list for the top 10 fights in the Transformers franchise. I'll be counting down the best fights from Michael Bay's films, and these are literally my favourite films. Number 10, Bumblebee vs the Kitchen Bots, Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. In this fight, Sam has found a shard of the Allspark from the first film, and he accidentally drops it into the kitchen, which creates life out of every electronic appliance creating many Decepticons. When they chase him out into the garden, he calls on Bumblebee to help him, and he blows them all away. This fight is both filled with action and hilarious. Number 9. Optimus Prime vs Bone Crusher, Transformers. This is, one of the f this is probably the first proper Transformer against Transformer fight that we get. But, but, sorry, Bone Crusher is one of the Decepticons who was on the freeway over to Mission City where Megatron will be waiting for them to find the Allspark. But Bone Crusher obviously can't wait, and he decides to cause as much havoc as he can while he's on the freeway. At that point, the Autobots are also driving there as well, and Optimus Prime transforms and stops Bone Crusher. They fight, f they fight on different levels of the freeway, so that it's a spaghetti junction. So, they end up on the bottom, on the bottom road, and Optimus thrusts his blade through Bone Crusher's face. Number 8. Optimus Prime vs. Driller, Transformers Dark of the Moon. Driller is the giant worm that we the Decepticon worm that we see with Shockwave. Optimus is in using his jetpack to fight him when he's wrapping around a building that has Sam and some and some old friends of his. And Optimus flies up and goes back through the building and completely destroys Driller by flying straight through him. At that point, Shockwave is well, pissed and decides to shoot Opt and shoots Optimus when he's about to take off, getting him tangled in a load of cables. Number 7. Ironhide and Sideswipe versus the Dreads, Transformers Dark of the Moon. And this fight, Sentinel Prime is driving along the freeway with the protection of Bumblebee, Sideswipe, and Dino. But three Decepticons are intercepting. The Autobots take care of one, but two of them are still in pursuit. Two of them are still in pursuit. And Ironhide comes out to help. Sideswipe accompanies Ironhide, and they, and they go head-to-head -head with the Decepticons. <laughs> They start with a little Mexican standoff, but at that point, that's when it all breaks loose. Einhide uh, shoots uh, one of the Decepticons in the face, then sideswipes, decides to do some slicing and dicing. Number 6. Optimus Prime vs Lockdown, Transformers Age of Extinction. In the fourth iteration of the Transformers franchise, we see the main antagonist, the main antagonist Lockdown, go up against Optimus Prime. Lockdown has just come down from his ship to try and find him, and Optimus wants to finally confront Lockdown and end this once and for all. So their fight is is one for the ages. It is a truly brutal fight. Optimus is, uh, he's doing well, but he's a little, um, conflicted between having to fight Lockdown and save his new friend, Cade. Because a secret serviceman has, um, a gun pressed to him, so it's the first time that Optimus kills a human. But Optimus manages to prevail and jam his sword through Lockdown and bring it up, going straight through his face. Number five, Bumblebee vs. Rampage, Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen. In this one, Sam encounters the Decepticon Rampage, who is one of the Constructicons, and he's trying to keep him focused on him, but when he calls Bumblebee, he flips into action and wrecks Rampage completely. Rampage doesn't have much of an upper hand since his legs are only like a drill, but... It's a great fight, especially when the Decepticon Ravage tries to intercept and help Rampage. But it doesn't work since Bumblebee just rips his tail out and just rips Rampage's arms off. It's really cool. <clears throat> Number four. 
Bumblebee vs. Barricade. Transformers. This is the first Transformer against Transformer fight we get at the franchise. When Bumblebee is protecting Sam and Michaela from the Decepticon known as Barricade. And in hot pursuit of him, Bumblebee decides to face his foe in robot form. By that point, Barricade has a little friend of his own. He has the Decepticon Frenzy, which follows Sam and Michaela attempting to, ta attempting to catch up to them. But at the end of it, Bumblebee prevails over Barricade, leaving him in a scrap pile. But he's not dead. Unfortunately. Number 3. Optimus Prime vs Sentinel Prime. Transformers Dark of the Moon. In this fight, it's student against mentor. With Sentinel Prime attempting to bring Cybertron into Earth, Optimus decides to shoot down the primary pillar which is causing all of this. Which then gets Sentinel really pissed off, and he decides to come down and confront Optimus. This fight goes on for quite a while, but it's certainly entertaining. And at the end of it, when Sentinel takes one of Optimus's arms, Megatron actually saves him. I can't believe it either. Number two. Optimus Prime vs. Megatron, Starscream, and Grinder. Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. And this, this is the forest fight that blew everyone away. But this fight is one Autobot against three Decepticons. And that's gonna be unfair, but he manages to prevail, I mean, because it's Optimus Prime. Only managing to kill one of them, though, killing Grinder by ripping his face apart. And taking Starscream's arm off as well. That was pretty cool. But at the end of it, Megatron actually jams his blade through Optimus, and then fires his fusion cannon. All of this to protect Sam. It, it clearly shows that Sam is a trusted friend of Optimus. Number one. Optimus Prime vs. Megatron and the Fallen. Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen. This is probably my favourite fight. With Optimus just back from the dead, jet fired, and thanks to the Allspark... Optimus has just come back from the dead. Thanks to the Matrix of leadership, and... But he's not strong enough to confront the Fallen yet. So Jetfire decides to remove his parts so that the Autobot Jolt can electrify both of them, bringing all of Jetfire's parts to Optimus so that he has enough strength to confront his foes. At that point, the Fallen is prepared to steal Earth's sun, but Optimus destroys, destroys the sun harvester, which is what it's called, and he... He then has Megatron trying to defend his master, but he isn't strong enough for Optimus anymore. So Optimus has blown Megatron through a wall, and the Fallen is his primary concern now. As he jams his hand through his chest and crushes his spark, and says probably one of the most famous quotes, I rise, you fall. If you agree with my list, please comment, be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next week when I do another list of my top 10s. I'll see you guys later.